I'm going to show you a quick guide on how to um, format a uh, hard drive so then it works on um, Dios Mios so you can get Dios Mios to run on your uh, on your Wii so right now it's finding my hard drive and the program you're going to use is called see it there. It's called Ease Partition Master Home Edition. It's a free program on the computer. So I'm going to open that up. Once it's open, say so go to the main screen. Okay, and as soon as your hard drive is located which is right here it says it's unallocated that's disk 2 because I only have two hard drives in there it doesn't show up but I have it connected which is right here it's a, I don't know it's a 40 gigabyte Maxter in a case um, it's unallocated so you want to create a partition And you can name it like GameCube. So I'm gonna write it to GameCube. Name it partition. And the file extension you want it is FAT32, because that's the only way it can be read is FAT32. And you can name the partition size. So for the sake of our thing here, I'm gonna make it uh, 10,000 megabytes, which then gives me unallocated sp space on the other side, which was what you need to use, unless you're using it strictly for GameCube games. So I'll say OK. And then for the other unallocated spot, I'll probably just name it Wii Games. So once we make that NTSF, hit OK. Oh, I realize I made a mistake here. Um, you format the partition. The cluster size has to be 32. So you see where it says cluster size? It has to be 32 KB. That's hard to see. There, now you can see it. So if it's 32 KB, it's fine now. Now, the only thing you have to do after this is then you have to right click on the GameCube one and you have to make this the primary partition. Now, unfortunately, uh, this hard drive is messed up, but if you had a normal, you know, part or normal uh, hard drive that isn't screwed up and it'll allow you to do it. You right click on the GameCube one, which is FAT32, and you make it your primary. So, it, once it's primary, then the uh, Wii can read it and then it'll work. Other than that, it won't work. So, and then you hit apply. And I'll say, would you like to do the change the thing? And you say yes. It takes a couple seconds, and it actually formats it without having to restart your computer and take like an hour. It takes like only like five minutes to do. And then when it's done, it's done. There you go. It's been done. But the key thing is, is you want to have the GameCube one you do that's FAT32 cluster, 30, cluster size 32. The key thing for it is, is you want to make that partition a primary partition. And as I said, unfortunately I cannot do it. Um, 
notes to show you it but you would just right click on that part that one right there and it would say make primary partition and if you need any extra help you can go on this ease partition us um, website and they also have a little bit of a guide for that too but that's literally all you do and then what you could do if you wanted to is you can open up um, WBFS manager or um, and then you can change the, the NTSF NTFS one to uh, the WB FS type and then you can just put your Wii games on there um, unfortunately with this program you can't do that but if you have any questions feel free to send me a message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can on my channel. Thanks.